Alright people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Tuesday, and that means that we are using Teller Knights. So, uh, if you haven't heard already, I actually uh, purchased the cards. I actually did. I purchased all the cards that are needed for the Teller Knights, so that is awesome. So we can actually uh, start getting some more live videos with it. You know? They're coming in the mail. They're coming from all over the place, but they're coming in the mail. So, uh, you know what? I'm gonna activate Rudder. I'm gonna Rudder search for Vega. I'm gonna go Vega, Deneb, Deneb, search, and XC in the Castell and spin him back to the deck. Classic, get rid of the shit play. You know? If you go into, if you go first turn hair, then I'm gonna hit you with a, uh, then with a Castell. It's, it's as simple as that. You know? As simple as that. Um. Yeah, give me another Vega. I already have the Altair, so next turn I can go into, you know, like, the Triv play, or the Deltaros play. So, this isn't a competitive version of the deck. Uh, this is literally just, uh, a fun version of the deck, where it's just a pure Telenite deck. You know, it doesn't really run any background. I think the only background it runs is, like, uh, is, like, um, I want to say, uh, Phoenix Chain, just because, you know, <laughs> excuse me, good Phoenix Chain kind of works well with Triv. Besides that, there's, oh, in my, uh, counter trap. But besides that, no, there's not, like, you know, the competitive version with all the mirror forces and the mind crushes, because I'm not planning on taking this deck to, uh, any. Where, where, hello, where is all of your back row? Like, like, you, you're supposed to be using, I thought, I could have swore it, I thought you were going to be using Bujin bitches. Uh... I can go activate you, you summon you, you summon you. I'm gonna go on Triv. So activate you. You bring back Vega. Vega, go ahead and summon. No. no. Summon the Altair from my hand. Altair, go ahead and summon the Deneb. Deneb, go ahead and search me for Altair. I should have just set the fucking sky bridge. I'm gonna set the sky bridge because this is getting annoying. I'm not playing you this turn, right? Oh, it doesn't matter because then it's gonna go right back to my hand anyway because I'm going to Triv. <sighs> Triv! Resetting you though because that's getting kind of annoying. Oh, uh, unless I get a Deneb. I mean, unless I get like a. Oh! Woo! That sniper pick, like, ah, give me that, dude. You ain't taking my trim. I mean, yeah, my trip, motherfucker. Surprise, motherfucker. Ah, <laughs> uh, fucking get that broke snatch out of here. That's that shit I don't like. So I guess you're gonna go ahead and crane me. Don't even care. No, that's fine. Don't even care. Sure. Yep. Hmm. Some Vega. Vega. Some an Altair. Altair. Some the Deneb. Like you when you give him a monster, I'm still in it. The Nevs are trying all uh, other Altair. And then look what I can do. I can go to Triv again. Oh, wow. The number generator is very generous to you today. Give you Smash Tail and Regeki. Alright, that's fine. I, I still have, I'm still up on resources. I can still go into another Triv. So I give, like, no fucks. Nah, that's fine. But I pick the snatch down your hand and you get Regeki, like, alright. And like the first, like, you know, five cards of your deck, you get both. So, number generators, generous, to say the least. So it's kind of bad for you that I'm literally just going to go into another Triv. I was going to go into another Triv before you regeki me, but then I got to go into another, another Triv through other means, because you regeki me. One of the reasons why I really like this deck is because A, I like stars, and B, I like 
uh, uh, staying up in resources. I love staying up on resources, which is exactly what I'm doing right now. True again. Kind of sucks that I'm not getting you know, none of my Novas or my Phoenix Chain or anything along those lines. I would probably make this a competitive version of a deck. Okay. Bye. That's kind of a waste of your freaking bunny. Give me that. You don't need that. You don't need your boot incarnation. So that. So that. So that. You're not actually Valkyrie. You know, I could probably take out the, you know, the warrior returning alive and, you know. Oh, you got another one. Oh, so that's why you want to do it, because you knew you were going to have at least one. That's fine. All I have to do is just trip you again. And I will trip you again. <laughs> so you're going to go into Sus Susano? I've been saying that monster's name wrong forever. Call it like Susano O O, like no Susano. Nope, 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 not. Right. Yep, there he is. Susano Wo. It's uh, I think it's Wo at the end. Susano Wo. No. Susano is the other one. All right. Come at me. So the only problem is the fact that you can attack all my monsters. Nah, that's fine. No. Yeah. I'll just summon the Duneb. Sure, give me a nuke. Even though at this point he's not that useful. Sure. Sure. Hope you got some back row. I have not seen any back row from you this entire duel. I guess you're running the Royal Decree version. <laughs> the problem with you running that Royal Decree version is because you really can't lock me down. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. Alright, well, I'm just gonna go into another fucking triv. Yeah, that's cute what you're doing. You, you, it's about to hire. Activate Skybridge and I'm gonna tag out Vega for a nuclear high just so I have something to search for with my old tire. Come on. So at this point, you might as well scoop it up. That's why this card is actually really good in my deck in comparison to other Teller decks because my deck's a pure Teller Knight deck. Oh, my only monsters are just Telenites, because, yay. Oh, I still have the Nebs in there. No, I'll summon a Nuclear High. No. Yes. Give me that Vega that I just put back in there. I mean, this duel's over anyway, but it's just nice to go ahead and stay up in resources. They're a tripper. Yep. Alright, let's get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, we're back. So I'm just sitting here testing for real life. Just playing the deck as if I, you know, have it in real life. This hand's not the best. So, yeah. Mm hmm. Alright. 
I guess I'm gonna sit here and watch you play with your law walls for a while. Yep, send her, her, send her, her, send someone else. Like, I don't know this flag. Oh, I got Anuk. Cool. Totally what I need. Anuk! Yeah, so I run you because you do help with my consistency. The only thing I don't like is the idea of her. There are three or more of the walls you must in your game that you can banish. Oh. Okay. Yes. I might set it all just to try to scare him. Yeah. I really don't mind losing this. I really don't mind losing that. And I really don't want to lose that. Because I know you're going to go like, perfect. Target one of your set cards and pop it. Like, all right, but which one? <sighs> yep, there she is. Nope, that's wrong. You popped my warrior turning alive. Congratulations. Congratulations, you won. Nothing. <laughs> I baited you. I tricked you. That's fun. Yeah. Alright. When this card is sent from Phil to Gary, I'll leave it to blah 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 blah. Are you a tuner? Yeah, you're you're a tuner. Hmm. Ah, uh, you see, the thing is, he's he might go into like a Goyo Guardian, and if he goes into a Goyo Guardian, I can't stop that. You know, a Shroud cannot stop that. Maybe better just to go ahead and trip him up. Ah. Uh, uh, you know what? I'll go ahead and over you. Got another Nova. Alright. Cause I was feeling you were gonna go into like a Goyo Guardian or something along those lines. So no thank you. So you went into a Goyo Guardian, there's nothing to stop, you know? By the time Goyo Guardian's already gone in second, the monster's already dead. Hmm. I never get to exit on anybody. <laughs> Always up on resources. I'm going to Castell, spin back the swords of Revealing Light. You guys already know how much I hate that card, so. Like, nah, man. If you want to fight, let's go. Alright. You want to fight? You you you, you tried to go to me, and then all of a sudden, when your plans get stopped, you're like, "Oh, pussy, pussy, scared, scared!" Like, no, fuck your swords, let's go. But no, he surrendered. All right, I have time for one more duel. All right, bear back. All right, last duel. Then I gotta go get ready for college. Go take a shower and shit. The sand is fine. I'm actually gonna go for. Unuk. Unuk, send the neb, and then I can... Wow. It's like a... Uh, Rhoda. Rhoda, I didn't even select what my... You don't even know what... De Any deck that has fucking warriors, no. Like, okay, okay. This man hates warriors. I was thinking about going, activate Rhoda, summon Unuk, Unuk, send the neb, and then I could star him, and then turn him into an Altair, and Altair can summon the Duneb, and then I could search, and I could set... You know, I could do all those plays. Anyway, my opponent quit. Bear back. Alright. Let's, let's go. Final duel. Final duel.
Alright, this hand's not terrible. Let's go Rota. Search for Deneb. Deneb, search for Vega. I already got the Altair in hand. Hopefully he doesn't MST my Call of the Haunted, and I can actually use my Call of the Haunted to summon back to Neb for another search. You know, then he's only gonna kill the Neb, and I'm like, alright, well, during your phase, I'm gonna activate Call of the Haunted, summon back to Neb, you know. So, let's see what we're facing off against. I got my powerful, powerful Alpha. Oh, alright, well, that doesn't reveal anything, because some decks play that card. Never mind, it is Black Wings. I was thinking, like, ah! This thing Zephyros the Elites doesn't guarantee it's Black Wings, but Bora does. So it's Black Wings. Alright. Nope, it is Black Wing. No, 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 it's still Black Wings. I, I forgot. Black Wings do play uh, this guy because they can use him for a search. Alright, that's fun. Set some back row. Icarus attack. Just sucks that you're not killing my, uh... No, wow, no back row. No back row. Alright. And I guess I will go ahead and go... Vega. Unuk. Uh, do I want a Nuke effect? That is the question. No, no, I don't need a Nuke effect. I already got Deneb right here. I only need, really, I only need one Deneb. Let's go for Triv. It's like dueling Bujins, except different. Put everything back. You cast it in Ev. Give me something out of your hand. You don't need that other Bora. You don't need more Boras. No one needs more Boras. I'm not going to equip the Alpha, because he can easily get over me. Ooh, but I can go into Diamond. But I really want Triv's effect, but I can go into Diamond. Right? Diamond, Diamond, Diamond. What do you say? In faces, blah 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 blah. Once cards exceed to a new player can send cards from their deck to a graveyard, and any card that returns from a graveyard to their hand is banished instead. Okay. The new player's turn when a dark monster effect is activated, you can attach exceed to and get that activation if you do destroy it. You know what? Sure. Let's go into him. I'm still fine with resources. So yeah, let's go into Diamond. He doesn't get used very often, but I just happen to be going against a dark deck. So. So if you try to go like summon a black wing. Attack with, uh, you know, like, you know, attack, drop clue. Like, no, 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 I'm drop, I'm gonna negate that clue. It says, when a dark monster effect is activated, period. So that includes hand or graveyard. So. It's not even once per turn, it's just a turn either player's turn. So, I can, use, I can just negate all your dark monster effect. The only thing I'm trying to think is if he goes, like, special summon, like, you know, summon a black wing, special summon a black wing. I can't stop that, then go into, like, cast stealth. Then I'm screwed, but... I'm still okay because I'm still up on resources. Well, I'm not technically up on resources. I'm still okay though. I still have resources. What I meant to say, I'm not up on resources. We're even right now. You know what? My punch is gonna set some bro. You know what? You know what I should have done? I should have equipped him with the alpha. Ah, I'm an idiot. Noden. Yep, there's Noden. I should have equipped. Diamond with the Nova. My bad. My bad. I fucked up. If I would have kept him with the Alpha, then psh, suck my dick. Because he couldn't even cast Stell me at that point, but I fucked up. I misplayed. I misplayed. Fuck. Castell? 101. Same thing. I fucked up. I misplayed. Fucking broken. Fucking broken ass Noden. No, I don't even get returned to the extra deck. This is just a thing. The good thing is the fact that, uh... Is that at least I don't have to worry about Ekros attack, right? But yeah, I messed up. I should have went for, uh... uh I should have equipped him with Alpha. If I would have equipped him Alpha, this deal would have been over. So, my bad. Seriously, my bad. I misplayed. See, now I can equip Deltaros, but you can easily run me over with, like, uh, and you got some back row, too. You could easily run me over with, uh, ah, uh, fuck, I'm trying to think. 
a Kalut. Well, you wouldn't be able to do it if I had Diamond, so I misplayed. You should have bottom list a lot earlier, sir. This is this is target one warrior. Are you a warrior? No, you're a worm. Damn it. So if you were a warrior, I totally would have just, you know, returned you. I misplayed. God I misplayed! I misplayed so fucking bad. I could have equipped you with Alpha and you would have been a fucking 32 invincible ass monster. That fucks up all his dark monsters. I fucked up. God, I misplayed. Hmm. I'm thinking about activating the Call of the Haunted. No, because then the monster will die. I'll just take the 19. Even though I'm, I don't plan on going for Triv this time, I plan on going into Delta Rouse. Wonder if that's an Icarus attack. God, I misplayed. I so, so fucking bad. Like, I'm so fucking bad. Like, how could, how could I be so bad? How do I teach these kids? God, I fucked up. <laughs> Alright, well. Let's find out if it's an Icarus attack or not. If it's a Nickers attack, you play it now. Right now. Do not wait. Don't wait. Play it now. Play it now, because when I go into Delta Rose, you can't play it, and then I'm going to equip my Alpha, and then you're I'm going to be unaffected. So. Nickers? Swallow's Nest. Alright. Alright, well it's pretty obvious that he wants to go ahead and attack over me, so... I'm just not gonna attack. I'm gonna set the Phoenix Chain, and then if you try to come after me, I'm gonna Phoenix Chain you. And then I'm gonna pop you. Because it's pretty obvious that you're gonna have, like, a... Clue. That's the only thing I can save you right now is the fact that if you have a clue or not. If you don't have a clue, then... You're not getting over me. Alright, you're gonna return him to the hand. Seems that. I, I shouldn't even be dealing with this right now. I should have an invincible ass diamond on my field, but no, I fucked up. I totally forgot to equip. That's fine. XE into 101. Okay, that's fine. <clears throat> it does absolutely nothing to me. God, Alpha, you're so powerful. You're so strong in the handsome card. <laughs> I misplayed too. Oh, yeah, I'm supposed Played. I could have ended this duel. I wasn't even paying attention to life points. I misplayed again! <laughs> Why? <laughs> I misplayed again. <laughs> uh, I won't even have time to shave. Ah, fuck it. Come at me, bro. Nope. <clears throat> obvious clue is obvious. <clears throat> That's game. I won. Yep. 
Alright, so test in real life. What did I learn? I should have equipped the damn diamond with Alpha. I forgot I could go I could can equip him. I would have been a 32 invincible ass motherfucker. I mean the Delta Rose worked, but he wouldn't even be able to collute over me, because if you would attack, activate collute. I mean like no, negate. Crash into me. Field unchanged, but nope. I fucked up. I done goofed. Twice. <laughs> but we're still okay. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call up so so um, if you guys do not know, today there's going to be a live stream on DN slash YouTube at 4 p.m. Pacific time to celebrate uh, the new channel, Renovation. So if, if you haven't seen already, just, just go to the channel. Just go to the channel page and you'll see it. You know, new thumbnails, new uh, uh, banner, uh, got a new map, some business cards, like all new, all new. And uh, also to celebrate Vime and Y forever, episode 500, half of 1000. So. If you guys can go ahead and make it, that'd be awesome. I'll be streaming for like an hour to two, and uh, at the end of the stream, I'm gonna get take everybody's name who's on who's on the stream, slap into a number generator, and uh, uh, whoever the winner is will receive a signed map from me. Yep. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this, and I hope you guys will enjoy the live stream. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow using uh, Clebola. All right, people, thanks for watching.